What's up, boys? Outsider is back, baby. Basketball season just ended, y'all, and I am not more stoked. So, well, I love basketball. I'm not, I'm, I'm saying I'm stoked for what's after. So, we got all this lawn care already. We just got finished with a two-hour yard cleanup. Um, if you guys didn't know, I run my own landscaping company. And uh, so, yeah, we just got done with that. Now, we're going fishing. So, two best combo right there, making money and then going fishing and filming for you guys so you guys stay tuned i'm gonna get all this and i gotta burn it and uh yeah so i'll see you guys soon um it's gonna be a banger we're doing a little bit of bass fishing today it's the second time i've went out this year me and my girlfriend went like a week or two ago and we got skunked so uh the other day i went caught three so it should be a good day so we're going after the dinks we're, we're just gonna have a good time and yeah we'll see what happens All right, y'all, so uh, you guys are probably wondering why the MTB featuring MTB is in the title. That is because we are spicing today's video up. Uh, I actually, my mom got me this subscription and she got it in Christmas. And you know how it goes every single month. It wasn't like the summer months. So I've just got like five MTB boxes from when it was iced over. So I just grabbed a, a random box and I all my other tackle is in my uh, boat and storage right now. So I don't have any of that. So. I've got one bait tied on that I know I hope will work and then I've got a few others and a mystery tackle box that I just randomly grabbed so it should be a pretty interesting video I'm just happy to get out and fish so you guys stay tuned I can't wait to freaking get a video out to y'all and yeah we're starting to grind this crap again uh, basketball kind of took over for a couple weeks there so yeah but let's get to the pond and let's get to fishing y'all we got the elusive geese and then the elusive turtle He's about to plop off that thing. Watch him plop. He's about to go. Oh, oh, there were two. Perfect cast. Oh, we had a stick. We had a stick. Man, what the heck? some action. Oh. Let's go. We've already hooked up, baby. See, now I told y'all we aren't catching the big ones, but we're having a good time. Look at that. Yes, sir. That is the first one of the day, and many more to come. All right, y'all, so we got a special guest on the show today. We got Mr. Connor Bishop here, professional fisherman, right? Now, we're looking in the box of, of happiness, right? We got a big spinner bait, some nice hooks, some nice worms, some nice crawdads. I don't know what month this is for, but this looks just like every other month. Oh. Oh my God, bro. Ooh. We got the craw daddy, the craw daddy color. We might be using this today. I think I'm gonna tie this on first. We also got the rod that I'm giving away. Uh, but that giveaway is over. So this should be shipped out to the guy soon. Who won it? <laughs> <laughs> Some guy. <laughs> All right, but I'm tying this on Mr. Craw Daddy special and we're getting some fish boys. So Connor's got the little craw daddy on too. But he's got the little, I don't even know what you'd call this, but it looks a little bit more lifelike. Mine looks more like a, they're both crankbaits, but uh, his is a little bit more segmented. Mine's just a casual crankbait, you know? And we're tying this sucker on here. This thing looks absolutely sick. All right, y'all, so we got a left-hand bait caster right now. I'm not normally left-handed. We got a deep pond, so let's let her rip. Oh wow, got this nice floral on here. Nice 
crawdaddy crankbait. What do you say? Oh wow, that thing just looks magnificent. Magnificent. The crawdad. Oh yeah. See you guys. 13 fishing bait right here. Beat Connor's bait. Mystery tackle box, baby. That is something else. We're just destroying Connor already. See, he's got a tree right now. He don't want the smoke, boys. Wow, this might this might be this might be the same exact fish I caught earlier. Oh! I hate treble hooks. Ugh. God. Well, they ain't going to see it because they're deep. Maybe. I don't know. We don't know yet. All right, all right, all right, all right. Chill, Gobby. You guys know what a Gobby is? If you, if you don't know what a Gobby is, y'all are some OGs if you know what a Gobby is. Uh-oh. It's in his tongue now. There we go, boys! Oh my god, I just got lightheaded. Oh, oh, COVID. Oh, 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 oh. See, see. That dang ain't worth It's gonna work. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Holy! <laughs> You'll see this nice. Uh, windy day. We got the spinner on. Col I think it's the Colorado blade. And uh, yeah, we're gonna see what happens. We 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 had graduated from the uh, the little the little the little other gobby. Y'all wasn't wasn't filming, boys, but we already caught one on the dang Colorado blade. Oh, who, who are we looking for? You know, I've caught three. Connor still has zero, but it's not everybody's game. So, oh, look at that! Look at that sucker! Yes, sir. This is a Guggen Bates. He choked that thing. All right, y'all. He came from deep. He's he's a little cold, and fishy. Connor, you wanna feel what a fish feels like? Get out of here! I'm gonna catch yeah. one right here. Yeah. I'm gonna catch one. He did the Harlem I'm about to catch this one. I'm about to catch this. Do it. Come on, Connor. Pressure's on. He, he promised me a hundred bucks if he doesn't catch a fish right here. Well, you see, the dog barked and. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. We're really going crazy now. Yours goes to the other side of the pond. Mine goes like five feet out. That's because you got a dang spinning reel on a bait casting rod, Connor. <laughs> You're throwing like a two foot deep shallow lure and the middle of the pond's like 10 feet. Uh oh. Uh oh, SpaghettiO. We got a backlash, boys. All right, y'all, so Connor isn't catching a fish, so. <laughs> Just got the springtime, coming right out of winter, he's throwing a frog. He's actually throwing the frog. That, 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 that'll probably cook him here. The old rooster tail. Dude, I just turned the camera on and you didn't even have a fish. I think he just got caught on a rock and thought he had a fish. <laughs> Come on, Connor. All right, y'all, little mid-game episode. Connor still hasn't caught a fish. I haven't even cast it in like 10 minutes. Actually, it hasn't been that long. Let me just get her wet. Okay. <laughs> Alright. But, you know, he's got a new bait on, so apparently it'll work. And if you guys haven't noticed yet, he's got a spinning reel on a bait no, casting someone rod. Someone says in every one of your videos, I get it. Okay? I don't want to get a new one. <laughs> <laughs> that is a huge fish. That's like three pounds. Oh my gosh. Dude, this is how you know they're big. Oh my god, five pounds. Five pounds. Wow. 
way to release it. Way to release it. I should have put on a chatterbait. But I don't have one on me. Oh, my God, I got another one. Oh, oh, oh. Doubled up. Doubled up. Doubled up, baby. Dude, he's just circling in. He's circling in. Wow. Now this is a moment here, boys. Wow. What a that is what you call a double... Doubled. That thing just nailed the water. <laughs> Connor just caught up in one spot. I gotta start doing something. Oh God. All that crap I was talking is coming back on me now. Hooked up, hooked up. Never what? Yep, that's a good lesson, Connor. We're right in the money. What am I at? Five or six now? Five, yeah, me too. Things for days, good things are fun. And sometimes you gotta settle just to fish, you know? I'm having fun, and that's all that matters. Even though all my friends tell me all I catch is dinks. It's all good. No way. I was posting on Instagram and I just got caught lacking. Because Connor just caught another. Where are you at? Like four? Dang. Alright boys, I'm starting to take offense to this madness. Oh my god, dude. That is a massive bass for this pond. Connor literally just caught up. You got all your fish out of the same exact spot. This, oh man, that is a that is a chunker. You know, if you guys knew this pond, which you probably do, from man, that's like a pound. Good, nice, nice. Connor is on his seventh fish in the same spot, and he's probably cast it about twenty times. Oh, Dr. I mean, Dr. Doofenshmirtz. <laughs> nice close up of the fish here. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's it's the freaking tackle box in her butt, dude. That's what it is. All right, y'all, so for the third bait we got, we got some Carl's Amazing Baits. Little crawdad. Um, it's got these two little flapping tails. Look like they're real ton of action. And I'm just going to put it on the net head and see what happens. So, uh, got some, got some bait in this bait for sure. All right, y'all, this thing looks absolutely mint. So, you know, I hope we get your fish on it. Uh, Connor's about to start just destroying me, but maybe the next pond favors this bait more than his and we can make something happen. He's at like seven now. He literally caught seven in the same spot. I don't know how he did it. Well, we always catch him off camera, but I was just dipping my bait in here first cast. And I think we've got on a little a little move here with this uh this Carl's bait and tackle craw. This thing is sick on the net head. Uh Z-Man made that, but this ain't a bad one. I mean, that's a little bit of a chunkier one, bud, for this pond. We gotta take a fish selfie now. And off he goes. I bet you I get another one. Dude, did you even know there was a drain right there? Cast your thing right along that wall. Dude, I just had one and it broke me off. 
Dude. What? The absolute poop just happened. Look, that's my knot right there. It didn't come untied. No, it, just it literally just broke. Probably a turtle. It seemed like a fish. I don't know what, how that would happen. Harmony Fishing Company. All right, y'all. I just came to a conclusion. So we just caught one on that uh, that little the little gobby creature bait from Carl's. So now we only got one more bait left before the MTB slam is completed. All right, so we gotta get the the Western Scandinavia stick worm in a bass's mouth. Hopefully this other water over here is dirty because I got a dang black and blue freaking craw, or not craw, Senko. Not even a Senko, it's not a Yama. These things got good action, look at that. <laughs> yeah. Wow, Connor, I didn't think we could get any smaller, but at the new pond it's even smaller. We're just fishing this nice little sewage outpost right here i don't know if you guys ever saw my last video where i literally lost the biggest fish of my life right there and just started going crazy and then we got kicked out by a guy i'll link that video but nice little dinker Yeet. oh i just got bit i don't know what it was though maybe a bluegill no that little fish dude did you just get hung up because i just had a fish we may have just crossed lines but i don't know know what i'm saying smalls there he is there he is come to papa come to papa well i mean if there were bigger fish in here we'd be catching bigger fish No cap. I've never caught a big fish out of here. Dude, there's there's catfish in here, though. We need to try catfishing in here. Because I hooked into one late at night one time, and it broke me off. Oh, yeah. That I'm hunting all them pond monsters. We're hunting all them fish around here this year, boys. No, it's not. This one's plump. Guys, I've caught four fish in a row. Connor's really feeling what I was just feeling now. Connor. All right, y'all. This is like the fourth fish here in the same dang spot. I think it was a good idea to come over here instead of staying in Connor's little camp out over there. So you get the release for the Instagram there. Let's see if we can get one on a fifth cast. Do you think we can? Just slow rolling it right in here. Coming to the drain. Just got bumped. It may have been a log. Let's see. By the time I expect it, it's not going to catch any. Yep. No fish. All right, we're coming in after him. I'll throw a little different approach and see if it messes him up. Oh Using a little weightless Senko trick here. I'm just got to complete the MTV, and then I'm going back to the spinner bait because that thing's just slaying them. Just about every person on this lake has kicked this out. But that's awesome. Get through, get through. Why is somebody walking? We were literally right in their backyard. Dude, I'm going over here to try to catch one on this. We are hooked up. We're hooked up. 
MTV slam. MTV slam complete. Let's go. Let's go, Connor. MTV slam complete with a dink. Oh man, I never felt so accomplished in my life. Man, this guy, I couldn't even tell was actually on it. But, maybe time to go back to the old spinnerbait. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but this is just going to be a dang, a great video. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Go ahead, drop a like if you can. Subscribe if you're new, you know. This fish is bigger than your arm. Dude, I couldn't even tell it was on there. Sometimes it's the littlest fish that get the biggest, biggest bait. <laughs> Dude, I had a fish and I was just waiting for the dang camera to turn on. Cause I was gonna go. Oh yeah, y'all hear that? Hey, old Ford baby. All right, so that is going to be it for today's video. We actually completed the MTB slam and caught a lot more fish doing it. Um, I know it's all dinks, but it's always a good time. And uh, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, without without catching big fish, I know I gotta make it entertaining. So let me know if it was entertaining. Let me know. I don't know why that just cut off the way it did, but yeah, let me know if it's too weird, too too freaking funny, too too whatever. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Let me know if you guys want to see more fishing videos. We got a lot coming this this year. Um, I'm just planning on. We just got out of basketball, and if you guys didn't know, I have my own landscape business. I said that earlier. I'd like to start making that a thing, and also making this a thing. So this year we are absolutely just grinding our butts off, and uh, yeah. So if you guys want to help me out, just leave a like on the video and uh subscribe if you haven't yet so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one outside or out peace